It's been about four weeks since my last training update. And I've got about 16 weeks until the Bear 100 mile race in September. So last month has been a bit of a roller coaster with training. And then I got the crazy idea to do a hundred mile weekend. For some reason, I decided to try and do a hundred miles this weekend, uh, but it won't be like a traditional hundred miler. So I'll take some rest breaks and I'll probably sleep overnight. I made a two and a half mile loop in my neighborhood and I thought, that way I could just have an aid station in my garage. And my wife and daughter could kind of help crew me from there. With minimum impact on their weekend. 17 miles in. Seven laps done. So my goal was as many miles as possible Saturday. 22 miles just about. Bridget's being my crew person. Not really. Kinda. <laughs> I have dropped my pacer. She is... Ready to kill you? Doing angry yoga. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm around just over 50K and I uh, just stopped. I had some hot spots on my feet, so I re-greased those up. That's about it. I'm thinking now getting 50 miles in and then I'll take a good long rest, maybe nap for 20 minutes or an hour or something, and then try and get maybe another 20 in tonight, sleep for a little bit, and then get up and finish off the last 30 kind of early morning hours, maybe. See how that goes. <laughs> that did not, did not pan out. Uh, the two and a half mile loops were relentlessly boring after a while. And then my wife, Danny had a, an allergy attack. And so we had to get her in at some point and on Benadryl and settling that down. So I transitioned to the treadmill for a while. Just wanted to make sure she was okay. And then I ended up finishing Monday morning running with a friend out at Chain of Lakes on the trails. So during that whole time, what's really, what's really kind of dropped off was my speed work and my hill work. So a little bit of a revitalization of the plan. I think I'm good. I didn't miss too much and I'm back on track.